problem number 23 in the network shown in figure 1.35 the figure 1.35 determine all branch currents and the voltage across 5 ohm resistance by mesh current method so this is the figure so we have to find the branch current that is ia ib and ic so first we have to find ia next is ib and ic and next we also have to find the voltage across 5 ohm resistance so this is the 5 ohm resistance so let us call this voltage across 5 ohm as v5 so we have to find all this four so first let us apply the kirch of voltage law to the mesh both mesh so let us uh, indicate uh, let the loop currents be i1 and i2 so this is the loop so this is another loop when we apply kirch of uh, voltage law we will get 50 minus 3 i a minus 5 i c minus 6 i a so we will further simplify this and we will get one equation that is nothing but 14 i1 minus i2 so we have taken a loop current right so this is nothing but we have to apply current loop current so when we apply loop current 50 minus 3 i1 minus 5 i1 minus i2 minus 6 i1 is equal to 0 so once we simplify this we will get the equation 1 and for the same thing uh, for the mesh bcdb we will uh, apply the cage of voltage law as a loop current i2 so we will get minus 2 uh, i2 minus 8 i2 minus 5 into i2 minus i1 minus 25 so once we simplify this we will get another equation equation number 2 so solving equation 1 and 2 we will get i1 and i2 so once we get i1 and i2 we can easily find out ia ib and ic so as we know that ia is nothing but i1 so therefore ia is nothing but i1 which is nothing but 3.378 amps and ib is nothing but minus i1 so i uh, minus i2 so minus i2 is minus minus plus so ib is nothing but 0.54 a so from the figure we can say ic is nothing but the addition of i1 ia and ib that is nothing but 3.918 amps so using once we get ic the voltage across v5 is nothing but v5 is equal to 5 into ic that is nothing but 3.918 into 5 so v5 is equal to 19.59 volts So nothing but 19.59 volts. So we have found out all the four values which are required.